Hey guys, so um, this is the DIY do-it-yourself video that I'm going to do. It's just like a really fun flower headband thingy. Great for summer. Um, it's like a statement piece. Um, you can wear it like with a white t-shirt or something. Um, and the back looks like the old, this is what the flower looks like, and the back looks like that. And I'm showing you that my cool zebra nails. If you want a tutorial, just tell me. And let's get started. Where am I pointing to? I don't know. Yeah, okay. I love guys. I'm sorry this video is up a day late, but I just I just had a lot of homework to do, so this is my DIY. And tell me if you like this. What you will need, a flower, like a fake flower, of course. This is just one from, oh, I'm sorry, I have the hiccups. This is just one from Michael's Craft Store. I know it's like two dollars. You need a bobby pin, a button, heavy duty scissors. It's best to use the fabric ones or like the really heavy. Oh my god, sorry. And the glue gun with the glue inside. The reason I have the peanut butter. Funny thing, um, when you have the hiccups, eat peanut butter. It'll stop the hiccups. So as you're waiting for the glue gun to heat up, you're going to take your flower, and they usually come with like a longer stick, but I cut that off first. You can cut that off. It's going to wiggle this part. Just take it off like that. So you have like the skin part thingy, and then the actual, what is it called, then thing. going to... Cut that off with the heavy duty scissors. Now we have something like that. We're gonna take the button. Usually these buttons have um, a side where it dips in. So you take the side where it dips in and put it right on this, on like the center. First put some glue in the side in the dip. Make sure the glue gun's hot. Let it heat up for a little bit. Be very careful. So put some glue in there and then just stick it in the middle. So then you have the button like that and just press it down firmly and just keep it there so it dries like that. <laughs> so next. Once it's on there firmly and tight, and do wait like about like ten minutes, and take your bobby pin, and you're gonna take the flat side, like this side. What you're going to do is put it, put the flat side with the flat side, so it's like that. But you're gonna glue it on there. So first, you're gonna put some glue in the very center and then take your bobby pin and just lay it flat <laughs> like so it's like that and then you can also put some glue around the button to just keep it secure let this dry for about 20 minutes 10 to 20 minutes so I am going to go do that and oh my god, I'll be right back. So after you waited about like 10 to, 12, 10 to 20 minutes, it should be all dry and ready to use. And you should like be able to like open it so let's try it out. So there you have like a cute little, well it's not really little, but you can use whatever size flower you want. But there it is, it's a little flower. It's nice for the spring, like first a statement piece. So yeah. 
And don't forget to check out my channel for more videos from me. Also, let us know in the comments below what videos you would like to see in the summer, like non-beauty videos, because that's what we're going to do. And also follow me on Twitter, and also subscribe to my channel. When I get to 500 subscribers, I will have a giveaway. Yeah. So thanks so much for watching. Bye, guys, and have a happy Monday. Actually, Tuesday. But whatever. The love is still there. Just gonna, I can't do that.